welcome back everybody, I'm the Blonde Fox, and today we're going to continue playing some more Genshin Impact. So we last left off, we were doing Razor's story quest, and basically, we ran into Razor in the Wolvendom Woods area, and he saved us from a bunch of slimes and everything that were attacking us, and basically we talked to him, and he said he was friends with the Knights of Favonius and whatnot, and he went back with his wolf pack, and we went to go talk to Amber, come to find out that wolves had been attacking Springvale. But that kind of goes against what Razor was saying, because Razor was acting like the wolves haven't been doing anything of the sort. So we're going to go see what's going on. And yeah. Also, like I said before, we're going to wish as we get, you know, wish it, like the primo gems and wishes and whatnot, because of the fact that we are getting very close to our pity, and I would very much so like to get a Zhongli. So yeah. Um, actually, I should probably just teleport to Wolven them. Be a lot faster. So yeah, that's pretty much all that's going on. So let's see. Do, 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 do. Let's see. Ah, there's Razor. Who's there? Chill out, Razor. It's only us. You are also knight. So, you don't know each other after all? That was an Amber? No, this girl also red, but not so Bernie like other girl. This is starting to make sense. Is this the wolf boy you were talking about? Correct, his name is Razor. Help me out. With what? No time, I sent Lupa call away. People coming, bad people. Those guys from earlier? I understand, but first, I have a few questions. I smell blood. Quick! Blood? I hope the wolves didn't attack those idiots. What if it's the other way around, Amber? What if those idiots attacked the wolves, huh? Ever think of that? <laughs> okay, let's see. Indiscernible blood stain. Oh, that's not promising. Blood droplets. Not human blood. Wolf blood. Lupa call blood. Lupa what now? Are you gonna tell us what it means yet? Lupa call is family fate gave me. When wolf accepts human as its own, or human accepts wolf, that is Lupa call. Sounds like gibberish to me. That's strange. Where does the word come from? Surely it wasn't made up by the wolves. It's just the name he gave. Who's he? Guardian of this land. Wouldn't that be Barbados, though? He is the ruler of Mondstadt. Enough! Another clue. Follow me. Hey, wait! This is your chance to prove your innocence! <sighs> He's already gone. Amber, shouldn't he be innocent until proven guilty, not guilty until proven innocent? Then again, I don't know if that's how the laws work in Mondstadt. Let's take out these guys before we continue on. I really do miss having the Animo Traveler. I really want to switch back, but like I said, having the Geo Traveler is useful for exploring Liyue. And we're gonna need it for the main story quest, I believe, especially if we don't get Zhang Li for the Geo. A reward on the road. There we go. Nice damage. Yeah, some items. Awesome. Okay, so case, I should be right up around this way, right? Ooh. Gonna need these. Wolf hooks are used to ascend razor. So we're gonna need lots of those. Ooh, and a chest hidden in the a bush. Reward on the road. Don't know why I climbed that instead of just walking up the path, but oh well. Oh, wolf. Oh. This is him. We find his blood. Bad men did this. I do agree that it's awful, 
But that doesn't change the fact that... We didn't attack village. Not us. A black wolf and his pack. Not from here. They tried to take over land. They broke the code. Whose code? Guardian of this land. That's now the second time you've brought that up. Tell us who that is. I take Lupa call further in. Follow me. Maybe you see. Amber, why are you being so mean to him? I mean, I understand, you know, stranger, people being hurt, the poor wolf baby. But you don't have to act like Razor's completely guilty. I mean, he's not even the one hurting people. So why shouldn't you trust him? And considering me and Pie Mom seem to somewhat trust him, don't you think you should take our Whoa, word for it considering all we've that done? From earlier was two meters high. Imagine how high this one must be. Ooh, pretty crystals. Okay, let's see, let's continue forward. Ooh, more wolf hooks, berries. Awesome. Lots of wolf hooks. Any more wolf hooks? Oh, what's that? Did I already activate those? Oh, I guess I did. I don't remember doing that. Have I been up here before? Because I do not remember. What's this? They're so huge! Oh, I love the design of this place. It's so cool looking. Hi, guys. Help me! Collect these! Aren't those wolf hook seeds? Crush them! Put on wound! Bleeding stop! It's true! Wolf hook seeds have a liquid coating that not only functions as a mild painkiller, but also has a hemostatic effect. I read that in a book. Why? I have no idea. Hooks help seeds move. Liquid stops pain and bleeding. Animal doesn't feel hooks. They take seeds far away. Purple teacher told me so. I stay here. Take care of this one. I answer Red Girl's questions. Right. And if that lot does come back, I doubt they will try their luck against a member of the Knights of Favonius. Your wolf friend is not clear of my suspicion just yet, but we'll still need to fetch those seeds. Unless she's being somewhat open-minded. I already got the book of hooks razor. Here you go. Looks like this can use to stop bleeding. Uh, razor. There we go. We're back. Have we got enough? Yes, enough. Razor was just telling me about the Wolven Code of Conduct. Mind-blowing stuff. Thank you. We've looked everywhere and haven't seen any other wolves. <sighs> yep, that's wolves for you. The one we managed to capture must have been sick or something. What are you doing here? Revenge! It's him! The one who was raised by wolves! Huh? So, it was you! I should have known wolves aren't smart enough to be behind this! I can't believe you would help wolves plot against humans! They throw you some scraps and you treat them like kin? Have you forgotten what you are? Enough! Yeah! You can't talk about Razor like that! The Knights of Favonius are gonna let this guy off? We did not raid village! 
What is this disturbance to which I awaken? This is no offering to Boreas. Not only do you come for my kind, so too do you fail to recognize your own transgression. Ooh, this is creepy. <laughs> Take damage. There we go. Finally, he's taking damage. You must clear name with your sword. I think he doesn't take ice damage, right? Or does he? Does he take ice damage? Nope, he don't think he does. Come here, you. Dang it, he moves too quick. Pretty much I gotta use Razor. Those guys were way out of line, though, going off on Razor like that. I mean, they seriously have no evidence that it was even Razor, because, I mean, again, they're just thinking, like, what, he's telling the wolves to do that? First of all, what would he gain from that? And then why would he line himself with the Knights of Favonius if he's the guilty one. You know, it doesn't make any sense. Then again, those guys don't seem too bright. Off we go. Okay, gotta be careful and ready to dodge. He's gonna do it again. I really like this boss's design. It's a really fun boss. Time. It's got some cool different phases and everything. get involved. This is for the wolves to settle between themselves. You fight not with claws, but with the sword. You strike not with teeth, but with lightning. You are human, Razor. I am not like them. I don't belong! You are no wolf. This is a matter for the wolves, and the wolves alone. And you... You are Razor's Lupacar amongst humans. Your nobility stands out against others of your kind. If you ever wish, you may train with me. I have nothing further to say. May we meet again, Razor and company. Hey, Razor, what's that look for? Why don't you come to the city for a few days? Yeah, you have a friend in Mondstadt anyway, right? You know, that red Bernie friend of yours? You're not safe in the wild anymore, but I know that you don't want to hurt them. I'm fine, don't worry, but I'm not city human. But also, not wolf. Razor? Thank you, Traveler, Paimon, and other 
red girl. Hey, we've been with you all this time, and you still don't even know my name? Goodbye. The meaning of Lupapu completed, and we got rank 23 finally. Yes, we can finally do the Rite of Dissension. And now we can also do the, the Wolf Weekly boss, which gives some pretty good drops, but we're not going to do that now. We're going to go to Leoa Harbor. Still need to explore the rest of Leoa too, but we'll get to that eventually. It's about time, though, we got to do the main quest, because we've been putting this off for weeks. Well, not putting it off, but unable to do it. We'll also need to get our adventure rank up reward from Catherine at some point. Might do that at the end of the episode. If you want to find the Geo Archon, this is the only chance you'll get all year. Guess it's a good thing Venti brought it up earlier. Otherwise, we definitely would have missed this year's Rite of Dissension. Do you know where it is? Well, Venti brought up the time, but Baimon knows nothing about where it is. <laughs> Look, we're already in Liyue. So let's go ask some of the locals. Oh, right. About the Geo Archon Morax. Did you know the Mora that we use is named after this god? But it's seen as impolite for people from outside Liyue to refer to the Geo Archon by that name. So we should refer to the Geo Archon by the name Rex Lapis, like the people of Liyue do. Well, that's interesting. So the two different names are like a distinction based on if you're from if you're from Liyue, you get to use his nickname, but if you're from outside, you need to use his proper name. That's interesting. I never noticed that before. Okay, I'm gonna teleport back up because I don't want to walk up the stairs. I'm lazy. <laughs> Off we go. Okay, let's actually switch to the box and let's see. So we'll talk to you first. You too wish to bear witness to the rite of dissension? <laughs> Me too. We all do. As a businessman myself, how could I not take interest in Liyue's most important business trends? The 17 predictions given last year made more than a few ripples throughout the industry. Mm. What's more, there's been a rumor going around that the Tianxue herself, Ning Guang, has been acting secretly in the shadows. She wants the rocks created by GeoVision holders to be exempt from taxation. Wow, that's some super professional legal stuff, that is! <laughs> to be on the pulse of the predictions and the market is what makes this harbor what it is. Among the seven, Rex Lapis is the oldest deity. His keen sense of strategy is well trusted among his people. Understanding the predictions as soon as possible can make all the difference in making your fortune. Okay, that guy's voice was a little creepy or was it just me? <laughs> like the whole time he was talking, I was like, he kind of was creeping me out. What do you have to say? Oh. Are you also foreigners here for the Rite of Dissension? <sighs> to think I've lived in the year all these years and never come to see this before. <laughs> I guess it's like they say, locals never visit the tourist spots. <sighs> I wish you well on your travels. Liyue always welcomes you. Okay, so you didn't have much to say, but at least your voice didn't creep me out. Oh. And what do you have to say? Rite of Dissension. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Isn't that today? Once a year, Rex Lapis bestows upon us his divine prediction, guiding us on how to run Liyue for the coming year. Last year, it was the Yuhang of the Liyue Qixing that was given the honor of asking for the divine prediction. The Liyue Qixing? Ooh, Paimon knows this one! Mon's status to freedom as Liyue is to contracts, Liyue has a strong focus on business and trade. The Liyue Kissing, the seven leaders of the seven enterprises of Liyue, hold true control over Liyue. That's what foreigners always say. But true control over Liyue 
will always be held by Rex Lapis. The Qixing is comprised of mere mortals. Rex Lapis is a god. Mondstadt's god is nowhere to be seen, whilst our god is forever with us. Stay in Liyue long enough and you'll see. Given that you just left your godless city, it's time you experienced what it's like to be in a city whose god has walked with it through all of history. Great! Then we can start our experience off with the Rite of Dissension! Good choice. Then get going. To the high ground. So it's up there. It's ironic though, considering <laughs> Venti is still in Mondstadt. He just, you know, doesn't participate in anything. Ooh, I want that purple landmark. Viewpoint. Okay, so what's the fastest way up there? I don't think I could climb it, so I think the stairs to go up... I don't think these go all the way up there, but I know there's a path over this way. Right? Because I don't think those stairs connect up to there. I could have swore there was a second stairway. Maybe there's not. Oh, I so wish I had more stamina. This would be so much faster. Come on. Regenerate. Come on. Regenerate. Uh, okay, yeah, it's the stairwell. Do, 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 do. This way. And it should be through that door over there. Ooh. Collectibles. Oh, I went some of these two. Haha. Okay. <laughs> The best time to make a wish is today, during the Rite of Dissension. Wanna give it a try? Ooh, yeah, let's make wishes. Oh, you also want a little Adepti luck, too? <laughs> Seems you know a lot. Making a wish during this time is sure to get you the blessings of both the Adepti and Rex Lapis himself. I've already made my wish. So you can take this. Great! Thanks! I wish I could find my sister soon. Is there a second one? Ah, it's over there. Your first time in Liga? Actually, it's my first time to see the Rite of Dissension, too. Ah, look, that's Miss Ningguang of the Liyo Shixing. Only those who have control in Liyue can preside over the Rite of Dissension. Oh yeah, not sure if you knew, but most of the Adepti appear in the form of various beasts. I heard that when attending these kinds of formal occasions, Rex Lapis himself appears as a celestial cross between two of Liyue's ancient mythical creatures. Ah, sorry, I shouldn't interrupt your wish. Please, take this. I wish I could get some leads from the Geo Archon. Great! Now that we're all done with the wishing, guess we can just wait here for things to get started. Hmm. Who knows how long that Miss Ning Wong lady is gonna take? is upon us.
Max Lapis have been killed. Seal the exits. <laughs> what? What's going on? Did she just say Rex Lapis is... The Geo Archon is... dead? Oh no! The Millilith! Looks like they're nabbing suspects who got too close! Paimon's freaking out! The killer is amongst us! Wait... We got close! Are we suspects? Wait, where are you going? It was a god we faced off against when we first arrived in this world, too. What, he thinks it's the same one that just killed him? Trying to capture oh, us, no. too, kind of thing? There's a whole bunch of soldiers out there, too! Oh, dear. Your identity! You may not be the killer, but we can't let them get you! But can we even get out of here safely? I do not know. Let's see, where'd that guy go? Okay, he's there. I'm gonna try to sneak around this way. I go back behind this way. I should be able to kind of climb up and over the building, possibly, maybe? I'm trying to remember how I did it on mine, because I did it in a way that basically I bypassed, like, the entire thing. I think I just climbed straight up there and went over the building. Found it to be much easier than trying to sneak through it all. I'm not the best at sneaky games. That, ooh, chest. That went downhill real fast. Like, that was crazy. Cutscene was pretty, though. So you shouldn't be able to see the flying man. Haha, <gasps> -ha, made it. There's nowhere to run. Hey, buddy. Hold still. Stop! Huh. Stop! Come with me. Just when muscles does magical floating use exactly? So insensitive! You have no idea just how tiring floating around. Wait. Just who are you exactly? Call me child. Child? What? So we're supposed to dote on you? <laughs> no, no, not at all. It's an alias of sorts. In Mondstadt, I don't suppose you came across a Senora by any chance. Senora? Child? <gasps> You're Fatui! One of the Harbingers! Oh, no. Don't worry. I'm not looking for a fight. Senora gave you quite the bad impression, huh? Pfft, that woman. Can't say I'm a fan either. Right. Let's forget all about her, shall we? I'm here to help you. I don't need help from the Fatui. Come now. Don't be like that. I'm not a bad guy. Oh, okay, perhaps I'm kind of a bad guy, but I'm not here to give you any trouble. Would it be too much to ask for you to keep the sword sheathed? <sighs> I thank you for your knightly nobility. I heard of your deeds in Mondstadt, so I couldn't help but notice you during the proceedings back there. And because I had my eye on you the whole time, I know it wasn't you. Someone else was clearly behind it. But... Regrettably, given I'm a Fatui envoy from Snezhnaya, there's no way I'd be trusted after something of this magnitude. 
The ruling Qi Sing of Liyue has always been overly suspicious of us. Well, can you honestly blame them? <laughs> Guess I shouldn't try to deny that. Okay, sure. Maintaining a distance between strangers is probably a good idea. Either way, I'm already used to it at this stage. But right now, if you want to clear yourselves of any suspicion, you need to get yourselves to Northland Bank. Staying here isn't an option. As the old Liyue saying goes, the walls have ears. Great, so now are we working with the Fatui? Mm-hmm. That little child is a really cool character, though. Just sucks, because every time they've done a test run of him or whatever, I've tried playing as him. It's just like, I totally... I, I'm Also, by the way, I'm running to the Adventure Guild to get a reward. Just FYI. Um, anyways... Yeah, for some reason, I really suck at playing Child, and I don't know why. He's a really great character, and I've seen just how good he can be, like, other people playing as him and everything. He's a really amazing character, but the problem is, it's like I said, I just can't play as him, and I don't know why. I have tried him multiple different times with multiple different builds and everything, and it's just, I cannot figure him out for some reason. It's just, I don't know if he doesn't fit my play style or what. Ad Astra it's just very annoying, because it's like, I can't, I really want to use him, but it's like... And because I love his design, his personality, and everything, it's just, I can't use him. I don't know why. Okay, so nothing too great out of that reward. But we are going to go ahead and call this part here. Let me check. Did we get any more Prima gems? Oh, we're so close to another wish. Oh, that sucks. And I don't know if I'm going to record another episode before Zhang Li goes away. So we might have just missed out on him. Or you know what? I was saving these to possibly buy characters, but we're gonna do it. We're gonna buy two of these. This may be really stupid, but we're going for it. End the episode off with a bang, right? Mission number one is... Ooh, it's a purple, okay. Okay, Yanfei. No, a sacrificial bell. Well, that sucks. Okay, come on, Zhongli, Zhongli, Zhongli. I think this is our like 69th wish, I think. And no. Okay, well that totally sucked. And I don't think, yeah, we have nowhere near enough of the points to buy anymore or anything, so... Well, that sucks. Oh well. Sorry guys, but it looks like we're not getting Zhang Li. But, oh well, pretty much we're probably gonna get whoever the next character is, we're probably gonna get, which I think the next character is Yai Mika, which is cool, but... All of her stuff is on Inazuma and everything, so that's gonna be next to impossible to level her up, but... Anyways, I digress. We're gonna go ahead and call this part here. Next time we'll continue on with the, oh, wait. Okay, hold on. Is that enough Primo gems? I forgot about, no, I don't think that's enough Primo gems because that was only five, right? Yeah, dang it. Oh, so close, still one more wish. But anyway, so yeah, we are going to go ahead and call this part here. Next time we'll go and meet Child at the bank that he told us to meet him at, and we'll continue on with the story, considering, you know, Rex Lapis was killed, so now what are we going to do? And yeah, thank you all so much for watching. If you liked the video, remember to like it. Comment down below with your thoughts and opinions. I look forward to hearing from you guys. And remember to subscribe if you want to see more from me in the future. Until next time, see ya!